Hey everybody, my name is Jeremy Deegan and today we are going to build a web design mock-up. Basically this is a rough sketch or a simple template that we will send off to a graphic designer or web developer to create our website for us. As an entrepreneur, we really shouldn't be spending a whole lot of time on things that we shouldn't be doing. So if you don't have special skills in graphic design or web development, you probably want to let someone else who has those skills handle that for you. Now we want to create a basic mock-up in Photoshop to show these people so that when they begin to develop the website they have a basic understanding of what you're trying to go for and the more information that you can provide to them the easier it's going to be. So let's go ahead and imagine for a second that you own an ice cream restaurant and I'm a customer that comes up to the counter and I say to you, I would like an ice cream sundae. After having many years of experience in the ice cream business, you know that everyone likes their ice cream sundaes differently. So you ask me, well, do you want vanilla or chocolate? And I say, well, a vanilla, of course. And you say, do you want bananas? And I say, of course, there's bananas on an ice cream sundae. And you say, okay, well, what about nuts? Would you like some nuts on the top of the sundae? And I go, no, I don't want nuts. I'm allergic to nuts. Well, just by asking some simple questions, you immediately find out what this person wants and doesn't want. And the more information you provide to the graphic design artist or the website developer, the easier it is going to be for them to get it right the first, second, or third time instead of having to constantly go back and forth and trying to guess what you're looking for. So back in our example, if I come up to your ice cream restaurant and I come to the counter and I say, hey, I would like an ice cream sundae, vanilla with bananas and Cool Whip and a cherry on top, maybe some chocolate syrup, but no nuts because I'm allergic to those. Well, you didn't have to ask me any questions and you know exactly what I want. You can go back and start making that immediately. And that's kind of what we're doing here. We're gonna make a very basic design of a website and just put down some crude information so that we can give that to the graphic design artist or the website developer and let them know what it is that we're looking for. So the first thing that we're going to do in this course is we're going to write down some ideas of what we want on our website. Then we'll do a rough sketch by hand just to kind of get some basic layouts in. It's usually easier to do this by hand because you can quickly pencil in or color in or, or write down on a napkin what you think this should look like. And if it doesn't look good, you can throw it away and start over again. Then once you have a good idea of that, we'll get into Photoshop and we'll go ahead and create some very basic elements and group those together so that we can move them around and see how it would align to an actual website design. So let's go ahead and get started in this course.